Hey guys, and welcome to another video. Today I'm showing you how to make my flow bracelet. Made on a hook. It's kind of like the Lacrimosa by Souls Provider, in a way. But triple banded and the center is different. But anyways, let's get started. I'm going to be using a double ended hook for this since it requires flipping. And double ended hooks make flipping easier. And the colors that I'm using are pastel purple, pastel pink, and normal pink, and black as my background color. Anyways, let's get started. So to start off, you're going to take your border color, or background color, which I said is black. You're going to make a cat band. Then you're going to pull another black through it. Like that. And then you're going to loop three black bands on each side using the normal fishtail technique. And now I'm going to flip it over. And do the same thing on the other side. Like that. And then you're going to start adding in your colors. So the first color that I'm going to be using is my normal pink. And I'm just going to pull it through these three blacks here near the middle. I'm not quite used to this hook yet. The hook's different than my normal hook. There we go. And then I'm just going to, ooh, thunder. <laughs> I'm just going to pick up these outer two black bands here and keep the middle-ish one dropped off. Next, I'm going to add my pastel pink. And to add that on, I'm going to pull it through the pink that I just added on, as well as these two blacks. I'm going to pick up the outer black and the pink, put the other end of the pastel pink back on. Then I'm going to use my last color, pastel purple. I'm going to pull it through the two pinks and the remaining black. Drop off the black, but pick up both the pinks. And while I do this, I'm going to make sure everything stays in order. So that there is normal pink, pastel, and then a purple. Normal, pastel, and then a purple. And it should look something like this. And now to finish up this side, you're going to pick up three blacks. You're going to pull one of them through the first two blacks and these three bands that you just added on. Pick up the pastels, then the two blacks. Pull another one through the first four bands. Pick up the purple and the outer two blacks. Then pull black through the first three bands. Pick up the, the outer two blacks. Now it looks something like this. And I'm going to flip my bracelet over and repeat the same process on the other side. It's exactly the same thing, it's pretty easy. Picking up your normal pink Pulling it through these black bands and picking up the outer two. Then you're going to pick up your pastel pink. Pull it through the first normal pink. Two black bands. Pick up the outer black band and the pink. 
and then last color which is purple you're going to pull through these three bands here and pick up the two pinks and drop off the black Then you're going to take three blacks, pull one through the first two black bands, and the three colored bands you added on, pick up the pastels, and the first two blacks, pull a band through the first four bands, pick up the, the purple and the first two blacks, and pull a band through the first three bands, pick up the outer two blacks. Now I'm going to add a band to attach all these center colors together. Well, three bands actually. <laughs> three black bands. I'm just going to take my first one. I just like to like hold these aside. Make sure they do not unravel. I'm just taking them off because I'm really careful and I will not let them unravel. You can pinch them or safety pin them or whatever you want. Pull your black through these middle six colors. Then you pick up the pastels and leave the normal pinks behind. Next, you're going to pull black through all these six middle bands, including the new blacks that you just added on. Picking up the outer black and the purples I'm just going to make sure these are holding right now I think I'm going to pinch them now oh, what did I do? Sorry, I'm just having technical difficulties. All right, <laughs> making sure make sure that your purples stay in the very middle while you do this. And then the last time you pull a band through, pulling it through all these blacks and the purples. Now you just pick up the blacks and leave the purples behind. And then you can put these blacks back on your hook. All right. And after you do that, it should look something like this. And then to add on even more colors, you're going to do almost the same thing. It's a little bit different now that you have these center bands to deal with. You're going to pinch these first two blacks, pull your first color through these six bands here. It's six now, not three. Leave behind the middle black, pick up these outer two blacks. Do the same thing here. Leave behind the right black and pick up the two left blacks and then you're going to pull your next color through pulling it through this first pink pull it through the middle four black bands Picking up the rice rightmost black on both sections of black and the normal pink as well. And then you're going to add your last color, which is purple. Pull it through these four bands here and only pick up the pinks. And again, you're going to do the same thing, adding three blacks on this side.
picking out the pink, light pink and the pastel purple. Pull another band through, again picking out just the pastel purple. And then one last time. And there's that side. Then you'd flip it around and repeat the other side. Doing the same exact steps I did to add colors here, then adding three blacks on the outside. And once you have your six colors in the middle, you're going to do the same step that I did back here to add on your three black bands to put the middle bands together. And then you just repeat that process until your bracelet's long enough to fit around your wrist, and I'll show you how to finish. All right, I've gotten to the very end of my bracelet. And it should look something like this. And the point where you want to end it and start adding your little finishing parts is right after you add the three black bands to this middle cluster of colored bands. And to finish it up, all you have to do is go to one end, whoops, this part came off, <laughs> go to one end of your bracelet, pull a black band, through the first five blacks and you pick up this outer black and the new black that you just pulled through. And the next thing you do is you I'm just looking at the picture of my bracelet right now to figure out how to how I finished it previously. Alright. So next you're going to pinch this first black band that you just pulled through and then pull this black band through these five blacks here and then put the three bands back on your hook. Now you're going to flip your bracelet over and do the same on the other side. And now you're going to like I said, do the same exact thing. Pull black through the first five black bands. Pick up just this outer black and the black that you pulled through. Pinch this first black off. Pull your next black through the, five, the first five bands you come across. Put these back on your hook. And then to finish it off once and for all, now I'm going to pull the band through all the remaining bands on my hook. Now you can add your clip. Find the other end of your bracelet. Find the cat band at the other end. And clip your cat band. Like that. And there's your bracelet. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye. Have an even better day.